freaking popping people welcome to another video so uh guess what we're doing today we're filming fishing for giants episode five you guys have been killing it you guys have been loving it but at the end of this video i'm going to be introducing a new series onto the channel that's going to be even better than fishing for giants but stay tuned for that one because we got some good content for today we're about to uh Try to go fishing, catch some biggins, obviously. Film a awesome episode. So if you guys are new to the channel, I'm actually Noah. I'm the host of Kicking the Bass TV. If you guys are new, be sure to subscribe, hit the post notification bell. And also, if you guys have been enjoying the content lately, be sure to pepper that like button. Without further ado, we're gonna hop in to today's video. Let's kick it. Yeah, that's a young one. Really big. You need help? You need help? God, oh, jeez. Talking about baby. Hey, hey, I got a giant. I got like an eight pounder. Oh my god. God, I got another one. Oh man. Bro, this is a giant, Adam. You got one? First fish of the day. He's a Twinkie. He's a Twinkie, but it's a fish. It's the monkey off your back. Let me see. Boom. First fish. Boom. I don't know how if I hook a giant off this dock, I might get screwed. What the heck? <laughs> what the heck did I just hook? Like a rope? That's not what I was wanting to hook. It's got a rope and someone already has a ton of fishing string on this. It's not what I want. No, no, no. I leaned into him, I was like, there's no way that's a fish. And if that is a fish, he's a freaking toad. But no, it has to be a handy dandy rope with a bunch of fishing line, right? Oh God, he slapped. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. Really big. Four pounder. Four, oh, he ain't. He about three and three quarters. Talk about eating that bait, baby. Fish for Giants, episode five. <laughs> We're gonna need some pliers on this one. Look at that. Dude, this is a heavy fish. I know you can't feel it, but that's a solid three and a half pounder right there. He's very heavy. You ever get those fish that are just like, we gonna get this trap out and I'll get him back in the water, but look how he ate that thing. Smoked it. Smoked that red trap, baby. That's my first fish of the day. Solid three and a quarter, three and a half pounds. A little fatty on the old trap. Let's get him back in the water. You guys are wondering what trap I'm using? I've been using the Booyah, the Booyah little red trap. That's one of my favorites, the one knocker by Booyah. The one I'm throwing right now and what Adam's actually throwing as well is a two tap by Strike King. It's got the tungsten and weights in there. I haven't really experimented much with it, but that is my first two tap fish right there. And it's a, it's a nice one. I do not mind catching those. That's not a giant, but that's a quality <laughs> one. God, dude. Dude, he went right <laughs> through that tree. That's sweet, bro. You need help? You need help? God, oh, jeez. Get him, get him. Hey, stop. You got it? Yeah. Heck yeah. So just a quick little update. I feel like I don't do these anymore and I feel like we need to. Um, this has been super tough today. It's getting a little chilly and the fish are just not biting. So what we're gonna do, I'm actually gonna go back to my place, get a little bit of daylight before it gets dark and try my backyard pond because there's some good fish in there. The really good quality, you know, the good size. If you catch one, it's like two to three pounds and I'm so down to catch one of those right now. So we're gonna run back to my house, try the backyard pond and see what we can put together. You hooked them out there, didn't you? This dog is shut up. He's small. <laughs> You hooked them way out there. Yeah, so far out there. <laughs> That's usually not what we catch out of here. I'm telling you, they're usually fat, but it's a fish. You you caught them on your end of your cast, didn't you? Oh, yeah. The very end. Not much. Let's see if we can catch another one. fish. Oh, man. 
Bro, this is a giant Adam. Adam. Oh my god, that's a carp. Bro, it is massive. I hooked him in the tail, bro. I was about to say, I think I have my PB. I was like, <laughs> bro, I about had a heart attack. Because I knew it was a fish. Because when I hooked, I felt him wobble. And I'm like, oh, no. I was really on the bottom. Good thing I barely got him, so don't rip him. Just make sure he don't take off. That's a freaking toad. This is giants right here, guys. <laughs> I thought I had literally like a 10 pounder. There you go. Oh, come on, buddy. Oh, I was about to say. Dude, that's a big man. There he goes. Let's kick. Come on. There you go. Dude, that's a big boy. About three foot long. <laughs> Dude, that was crazy. No, I like leaned into him and I was like, oh my gosh. That's why I was like calling your name. I was like, bro, this ain't no, this ain't no deal. <laughs> there was no doubt in my mind he was over 10 pounds. <laughs> Hey, big. Oh, no, he ain't. He ain't that big. He felt big for a minute there. My hands are just numb. I can't even feel my fingers, dude. That is my first fish of the day on the fish head. A little fat bass. Was, look how little fat, fat and thick. It is cold this morning, guys. It is 25 right now. Holy smokes, is it cold. Baby. Can you eat the weight? Yeah. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Dude, that is honestly the crazy. Look, his hook's up here, and the fish ate the weight. <laughs> Bradley's got one too. Dinks. Dink City. Dude, that is crazy. You think he even bit it? It's all twisted. It's crazy. There he is. Fight so hard, dude. Hey. All right, now they're starting to bite. Look at that. Oh, came off. Drop shot fish head. I got one too. Oh, yeah. Oh, double up. Look at him. <laughs> Oh man, both on the fish head. I think we found them. Perfectly in the top of his mouth. Let me see. So I'm trying to eat him? Oh wow. Yeah, so I'm trying to eat that fish, bro. Look at the side of him. Two little guys on the old fish heads. You feel him load up on it? Yeah. Uh-oh, he slapped me. Uh-oh. Oh, that's, that might be a good one. They fight so hard, it's hard to tell. I'm going sideways. Oh, why do they fight so hard, dude? I don't know the look. Got the dude. Got the dude. And the fish head, same, same time. Color. Look at that choking it. <laughs> That's awesome. That is awesome. They ain't big, but they fight hard, I can tell you that. Some about these fish in this pond, they just here's a little fatty. Another one on the dude. Tell me how you're uh rolling that thing, dude. I just reel it in real slow towards the bottom and then when I hit it, look a, <laughs> hit a piece of structure, just let it fall every time. And it's cold today, guys. This is uh this is crazy. It's been a slow bite, but they're really killing the dude in the fish head. Slow moving that thing. I got a little fat one, ain't he? Fat guy. It's not like number 10, 15? Oh, 10, 15, <laughs> something like that. I can't believe they're not sitting right here. Yeah, but I feel like they should be stacked, you know? I'm out of bite. I actually had one bite. Oh, yeah.
Oh, Dink City, but guess what? We're on a fish head bite. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> that fish looked like huge for a minute. That's a two and a half pounder. There we go. Building the bags. Oh, that's not bad, bro. Here's our kicker. <laughs> Got my kicker. Oh, that's stupid. <laughs> that is the best one today, though. Oh, oh yeah. I feel like, alright, we're going fishing afterwards. That was not bad, though. Wow. I actually really... What are you doing, Bob? Oh, my God. Yeah. That's a... Oh, dude, that's a better one. I ain't going to say he's good. Oh, yeah. There you go. Let's make it eight pounds, baby. Maybe seven and a half. Look at him choke that thing. Yeah. Yeah, that's not cold. <laughs> that is not cold. But look at, look at that, dude. He choked it, though. He did choke it. They just fight so hard, you can't ever, you honestly can't tell the difference. If you were to catch a five pounder in here, probably fight the same as a one pounder. No, that's ten pounder. Is it fighting like crazy? I can't <laughs> this one's a little bit thicker. Oh yeah. my God, dude, you got. You got him? Yo, you got, yo, he's got something big. Really, in real quick, Bradley. What? He was going to the side. You know how the big ones go to the side? I was like, dude. I was like, he's, he's got, got a man. giant. I'm firing him up. We're whacking him, dude, I ain't gonna lie. I didn't even move it. <laughs> Dude, I thought you, when, the thing is like when a fish goes, goes to the to side. The hey, hey, I got a giant. Guys, I got a giant. Guys, I got like an eight pounder. Oh my God, I got like an eight pounder. <laughs> oh yeah baby oh my gosh there's an eight pounder <laughs> on the freaking fish head so we talking about baby on the fish head <laughs> it's a solid eight pounder right there you gotta love catching those i hook set into them you drag right into them and that big guy and look at that fish it's a freaking toad. All right, everybody. Beautiful fish right there. Straight fatty. Wish I had a scale where I could weigh him, but solid seven and a half, eight pounder. Let's get back in the water. That is a freaking toad, dude. Look how fat he is. They're so fat. <laughs> God, if it wasn't that full moon cold front with this wind it would have been nasty oh my god god i got another one I about jerked the rod out of my hand bro i saw a two and a half look at him choke that thing i thought i had him again dude when i went up two pounder i don't mind catching him i mean this ain't much to an eight eight and a half pounder but so that's a that's a solid little fish What's happening today, guys, is big cold front blew in last night. It was a full moon last night as well, so today is one of the toughest days you could fish. Well, it's a little bit in the afternoon now where this bite's gonna pick up. You know, in the morning, it's gonna be a little bit slower. Obviously, at night, when it's dark last night, they were feeding. And it's in the afternoon now, and there's a bunch of rocks on this bank. If you guys don't know, in the wintertime especially, when that sun's beaming like today, and there's rock, very cold water, that rock heats up quicker than anything else. So this fish stack on it, and that's exactly why that guy was right there. But uh, let's get him back in the water. All right, buddy, I thought you were bigger than that. There we go. That is going to be it for Fishing for Giants, episode five. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys have been enjoying the content, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. But as I said at the beginning of the video, I'm gonna be talking about the new series that is actually coming to Kicking Their Bass TV. So we've had this whole Bank Fishing for Giants series. It's been amazing. I mean, it's really been kicking it. You guys have been not only enjoying it, but we have been catching some giant fish. Like, if you guys checked out the last episode, that was, I put all the big fish catches in the last like 20 days. It has been pretty crazy, not gonna lie. So with this new series, what I'm planning on doing is creating a series called 
searching for giants. So what exactly does that mean? I saw a lot of comments and people saying, you know, go to different ponds, go do this, you know, go to different locations, don't fish just the same pond, which I totally get and I totally understand. It is just hard with my busy schedule with places that are really close to me. And also when I'm sitting there catching an eight pounder every day, it's kind of hard not to go back. But with searching for giants, we're going to be fishing new locations. So places that we've never been before, and we're going to be trying to find the big bass. But it's going to be a whole process of us trying to find it. You know, what baits are we throwing? Why are we throwing this? Do we need to be throwing this? You know, this pond, we're going to try this pond and that pond. It's going to be the whole process of us searching for giants. So that is going to be the new series. I'm excited to bring it to you guys. I should have a new episode coming within the next week so stay tuned for that but overall thank you guys so much for the support everything that you guys do you know supporting me throughout all these videos commenting liking all the new subscribers thank you so much but i'm gonna stop rambling i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and i will catch you guys in the next video